DNS phase is the part of the cell cycle in which DNA is replicated, occurring between G1 phase and G2 phase. Precise and accurate DNA replication is necessary to prevent genetic abnormalities which often lead to cell death or disease. Due to the importance, the regulatory pathways that govern this event in eukaryotes are highly conserved. This conservation makes the study of S phase in model organisms such as Sinopis livis embryos and budding yeast relevant to higher organisms. S phase regulation, the G1 per second transition is a major checkpoint in the regulation of the cell cycle. S phase, to produce two similar daughter cells, the complete DNA instructions in the cell must be duplicated. DNA replication occurs during this S phase. Depending on levels of nutrients, energy and external factors, cells must decide to enter the cell cycle or move into a non-dividing state known as geophase. This transition, as with all of the major checkpoint transitions in the cell cycle, is signaled by cyclins and cyclin-dependent kinase. The pulse of G1 per second cyclins causes CLN3CDK1 to activate CLN1-2, as well as CLB5-6 at the initiation of S phase. This pathway contains two positive feedback loops, allowing for rapid, unidirectional movement into S phase. Redundant pathways like this are not uncommon because they allow for tuning the output of the system and often lead to faster genetic evolution. DNA replication The major event in S phase is DNA replication. The goal of this process is to create exactly two identical semi conserved chromosomes. The cell prevents more than one replication from occurring by loading pre replication complexes onto the DNA at replication origins during G1 phase, which are dismantled in S phase as replication begins. In synthesis, the enzyme helicase unwinds the DNA double helix, and the enzyme DNA polymerase rebinds free floating nucleotides to the separate DNA single strands in accordance with the complementary base pairing rule. DNA synthesis can occur as fast as 2,000 nucleotide second and must be as accurate as two wrong basing 1010 nucleotide additions. DNA damage Damage to DNA is detected and fixed during S phase. When the replication fork comes upon damaged DNA, ATR, a protein kinase is activated. This kinase initiates several complex downstream pathways G1 phase, causing a halt in the initiation of new replication origins prevention of mitosis and replication fork stabilization in order to keep the replication bubble open and DNA polymerase complex attached while the damage is being fixed. See also, S-phase index, S-fraction or S-phase fraction. References